Hi there, hope your Thanksgiving Eve's going along nicely. Hope you have the day off, can stay home with the kids, put your feet up, stay out of the cold. Well, the big storm continues to wrap up along the eastern seaboard. We're on the back side of it with north winds giving us some lake effect snow. So if you're heading out the turnpike uh, towards Cleveland, yeah, expect to see some of that blowing across the road, across the highway. Uh, these will slowly move to the east. Right now we've got winds out of the north. They'll switch to out of the northwest a little bit later on. We'll see this snow work its way east of Cleveland where we did see the heavy synoptic snow, the widespread snow, pretty much east of I-71. Uh, it got deep over towards Youngstown, uh, close to a foot of snow there, western Pennsylvania, up and down the I-79 corridor, more of the same. The snow's now wrapping up, so I don't think we're going to have a lot of travel problems today, the busiest travel day of the year, uh, with driving along roadways. It's going to be delays. Uh, cause and the ripple effect of those from airports from D.C. up into Baltimore, Philly, uh, New Jersey, New York Metro, Hartford, Connecticut, Boston, likely to see some delays because in addition to just the downpours, flooding rains, they've got some very strong winds as well. So we're going to see a ripple effect. If you are flying to travel today, uh, call your carrier before you head to the airport. You may see some delays as well. Even if you're not flying into one of those areas, it'll cause a ripple effect. So some lake effect snows in the viewing area, eastern sections this morning. We'll see those come to an end this afternoon, but we could see some snow showers here. The real story will be the wind and the temperatures and the effect of both. The wind chill today, bitterly cold and more of the same for your Thanksgiving. We'll start to warm things up once we get into your holiday weekend, but Black Friday is looking cold as well. So through the day today, again, the lake effect snow is moving to the east as we head into this afternoon. Uh, we'll see mostly cloudy skies, very windy, winds gusting to 30. High temperatures struggling to get up into the lower 30s, but with those winds, feels like temps. Even this afternoon, upper teens, lower 20s. Layer it up if you're headed out. Really cold overnight. We'll go partly cloudy and uh, drop down into the mid-teens. And for those football games, yeah, a good tradition in neighborhoods on your Thanksgiving morning. We can see some snow showers out there. Bitterly cold once again. Wind chills into the single digits early. We'll top out with highs and snow showers around on your Thanksgiving afternoon. Uh, right around 30 degrees once again. Wind chills cooler than that. Black Friday, busy day for shopping. In spite of some stores opening earlier, we're going to uh, start out in the upper teens Friday morning. We'll top out near the freezing mark Friday afternoon. A lot of sunshine with that. And then we'll finally start to get a little bit milder over the upcoming weekend. Still below normal, seasonal norms, but a little better than uh, the low 30s that we're going to see today. 31 the high with those winds gusting to 30 and some snow showers. Feels like temps. Closer to 20 most of the afternoon. Uh, for your Thanksgiving, yeah, we're going to start out on the cold side, mid teens, wind chills in the single digits Thursday morning early, and some snow showers possible on and off throughout the day. No big accumulations with that, but we'll see some snow flying. A high of 30, and again with the winds, it's going to be breezy on your Thanksgiving afternoon. It's going to be cold. And Black Friday cold as well, but we get a little bit better as we start a quiet period. Uh, we'll tickle 40 degrees by Sunday. Won't that be a nice change? And uh, we're mild, uh, a little milder as we head through the next work week. So layer it up. Make sure the little ones do the same as they head out. If you head into the store today, uh, it's cold out there. More of the same for your Thanksgiving and Black Friday. And then we'll get a little milder over the upcoming weekend. Thanks a lot for joining us for your web forecast on this Thanksgiving Eve. Hope you have a great day. I'm meteorologist John James.